First at five, reducing fires and boosting business. How the city of Bakersfield plans to tackle both issues. Thanks for joining us this evening. I'm Rochelle Murcia. And I'm Michael Patterson. Bakersfield City Council is taking steps to adopt an ordinance that requires vacant property owners and parts of Bakersfield to post no trespassing signage on their vacant property. Eyewitness News reporter Will Silverstein now has the story. Bakersfield City Council is hoping to crack down on both residential vacant property fires and vacant commercial property fires. It's a problem that is affecting multiple buildings and structures across Bakersfield. We do see a, a mix between uh, this taking place in commercial structures and residential structures. Bakersfield Fire Department's arson chief Bryce Patterson says vagrant fires are nothing new. They happen all too often in Bakersfield and pose risks to nearby people, property and responding firefighters. We do see more criminal activity involved with people breaking in, uh, doing drugs and also uh, setting those buildings on fire which uh, poses a risk to the neighboring residents and also to firefighters responding. 1412 Chester Place is boarded up. Chief Patterson tells us this is a site of several repeat burns and this doesn't happen to just tens of places but possibly hundreds of places here in Bakersfield a year. Last year uh, we ran a little over a hundred fires inside of vacant structures and some of those fires were repeat uh, at that same addre address. I want us to get on top of it right now. Vice Mayor Andre Gonzalez says the Bakersfield City Council is doing that by issuing the vacant property registry ordinance. The ordinance requires owners of vacant buildings without a plan to sell their property to register the building with the building department. There they will receive a no trespassing sign with contact information of a 24-7 responder who can be reached if there is an issue at the property. We would prefer a partnership so we can establish who is responsible, what their number is, making sure it's clearly posted, making sure the property is completely secure. Gonzalez touts recent development wins in downtown Bakersfield but infers the vacant properties can pose a risk if they are not at a minimum maintained. When they're unmaintained, when they're unsecured, when they're unmonitored, when there's no one around to watch them, they become attractive nuisances. What we want to do is we want to get on top of that. We don't want to wait. I, I don't want to wait for the next structure fire for us to then demolish a building and respond. Patterson urges upkeep with the property if you're an owner or an operator to avoid a situation like the one behind me. Reporting in Bakersfield, Will Silverstein, Eyewitness News.